Welcome back to Call Dibs everyone, back with another video, back with um, some more reactions because man, I feel like it has been 20 years since I've made a video. Well, I was on I was on a little mini vacation trip thing over this past week, so it's just been a little bit chaotic adjusting back to normal, but we're here and I'm not going to leave you guys on I'm not going to leave you guys on red, you know, like I see you guys out here commenting and all that and all these reactions you want me to do. And I see them, I'm taking my notes, and when I get to it, I'll get to it. So I'm, I'm not leaving anyone out in the cold here. So today, actually, I think, I know everyone wants me to do more Dreamcatcher and Twice reactions, and I have that on my agenda today, so those are coming. I really want to watch Weekly's new newest song for their comeback for After School, because everyone's been talking about it and going crazy over it so i just need to see what all the hype is i watched their debut video last year when it came out it was all right but their b-sides have really snatched me so i figured this one probably is getting popular for a reason so i have a feeling i'm probably gonna like it a lot so i have ducks in my backyard because there's a giant pond and they always like to quack in the morning and wake me up so uh, that's what that's about yeah this morning i was up at like four o'clock because these freaking ducks wouldn't stop quacking and i'm like <laughs> excuse you but that's not okay and so i was like up so i'm like well i just ran to starbucks and was like i'm just gonna get a drink sat and watch the sun come up sat in my car it was a pretty chill morning not gonna lie so and also i dyed my hair so i didn't do it I had a professional do it because I don't know what the fuck I'm doing. Okay, so we've got the captions on. So we're going to get right into this, guys. Hopefully we all can enjoy this new girl group. All right, here we go, guys. Okay. After school. So is it literally going to be them after school? But I love that format. Purple colors. Ooh, that was cool. Wow, this this freaking bass has got me going. All right, let's see where it's gonna take us. Wow, did you hear the way the notes freaking did? I, I don't even know what just happened. That sounded sick. Look at the format. Wow. I have to say, oh no. Okay. So, so far I'm really happy that they've kind of I mean, I know from their previous singles, they've done like, it's been more cute, and I'm glad that they're still doing stuff that's still kind of cute. It's not like super intense and dark like a lot of the stuff we've been getting from most of the girl groups who've been around for a while these days, but it's very refreshing and nice to see in the format. I love um, something super similar to kind of like what um, TXT and then also NCTU did recently with sort of how... I don't know, the formats in their videos are very much look like a scrapbook, if that makes sense. They've been doing elements of that in here, but next time, I guess, if I see that, I'll try and pause it on it. But, all right, let's keep going. This, this TXC did that. Ooh. This is just a straight-up serotonin boost, like, on God. <laughs> Like, okay, let's go back. Let's go back. Eh, where is it? All right, any day now. Jeez Louise. Like this kind of stuff, this is really cool. Oh, like this, where they've got like the tape and stuff. Like, that looks so nice. I love that. Like this just looks like, this just looks like they've had so much fun shooting this video. Like there's so much going on. The way that bass synth just kind of has that crazy shift 
transitioning to the chorus is amazing. I love that. Oh, the vocals. I have to say though, I have to say this does have a little bit more of a Western kind of inspired sound to it. I think it's the way they did the harmonies in this song. Um, but yeah, there's like, there's a difference in the way like our producers will make like K-pop harmonies and vocal sex versus like Western kind of style. It's different. I've seen like, there's this one girl on TikTok who I follow who explains it, but, um, cause she's written song, like songs for K-pop. So, um, yeah, I mean, it's different and this kind of sounds like it's, a, it's, there's less resistance and less tension than some other songs, but it, it keeps, it's very consistent and it keeps going and it keeps you interested. So I'm here for that. Let's go. This is perfect for summer though. The colors and how bright it is. Ugh, that was cool. That transition was really cool too. Also, oh, okay, there's a portal. Hello. <laughs> the random cat. I need to go back. The, the freaking, what is it called? Oh, there's a, t a specific theory term when the notes like just like climb down the scale. I cannot remember what it's called. But that just happened with the vocals. Everything dropped out and just, <laughs> let's find it again. Right around here. Jeez, oh, that gives you goosebumps. But yeah, some of the CGI. There hasn't been a crazy ton of that yet in this video, which is good. Don't overdo it. Don't overdo it. Wow. I love this. Like, this just... This makes me want to just jump into this world and go to the skate park and hang out with them. Like, this looks like a freaking blast. Wow. Oh. Oh, what's this? Oh, teaser? Easter egg? Huh? Oh my God. Bro, that was freaking crazy. I love that. Literally, Oh my god. I really have no words for that. That was just about everything I could ever ask for in a song, especially in 2021. Like, everyone's been pulling out all the stops freaking last year and this year, regardless of whatever's going on in the world. And it's just like, to see a rookie group like this really pop off. I call, I'm calling them rookies, okay? They just debuted last year. They're still new. Fourth gen, I think. It'd be fourth gen. Fourth gen group popping off. And, you know, we love to see it. We need more of this. Play M. Yeah, that's Play M. I need to double check. I'm gonna get this wrong. Play M, keep doing what you're doing. Just, just keep doing what you're doing. Victon has been popping off recently, and Weekly is about to pop off. So you know what? We love seeing all of these groups who aren't part of the big three just pop off, and it's it's amazing to see. Well, let me know what you guys thought about this song. How do you feel about, you know, the kind of vibe that Weekly's kind of been giving us so far. If there's anything I should know about them, why are my hands so dry? Oh my God. If there's anything I should know about them, leave that down below. Literally any thoughts, anything that is interesting information and it's valuable that I should know, leave that down below. This makes me so excited because yeah, everyone's, everyone's just been stepping up to the plate and just knocking it out of the park and you love to see it. And you love to see it from a rookie group, from a, relatively small company so you know anyways thanks for watching today guys i appreciate it so much i appreciate all the love i've been getting and anyone who's been like reaching out to me or whatever um i appreciate that so much yeah if you guys have any suggestions on things i should do um drop that down below i'm open i'm open to any suggestions i may open a patreon soon 
do something like that but i just have to plan that out but yeah if you guys haven't already please be sure to like and subscribe down below as more content is coming soon i am shooting so much content today i need to get it out i need to make up for me not being around for the past few days or so whatever and yeah so i'll see you in my next video guys take care and stay safe